Yo, what is going on, YouTube? Llama here. We are back with some MLB The Show, and I wanted to show you guys, this is something you should all be doing now. Um, that'd be cool if I didn't stutter in my intro there, but we're leaving it. Let's let ourselves sound special here. So what I am doing is trying to finish off um, these Team Affinity and Set 3 collections. So let's check out Team Affinity first. So I have collected, if you see on the right side, 45 of these guys. So anytime you collect so many, you get these little... Um, players here who are kind of locked you can't buy them on the marketplace they're locked behind set so you can see this shane uh, mcclanahan is pretty dope uh spencer strider is good and um strider and freeman both have captain ability so you can see once i get more team affinity guys he has a great tier 3 captain boost and he's actually really good to use as the 95 overall anyways once he gets that boost he'll be really good um need five more of these guys to get louis arias and the one i'm actually really going for the most is this jose ramirez so check it out he's a switch hitter uh, third baseman, really great speed for him actually, 84 for him is pretty solid, um, really good power, really good contact, great vision, good clutch rating, so need to collect more of these guys to do it. So how can you collect more of these guys? So for Team Affinity, this is how I found the easiest way to do it, so let's go ahead and check out the program first, so programs, Team Affinity, um, so you can see I'm about a little almost 50% on some of these, a little bit over on the other ones, but it has this timeline here. So you can do the moments. I don't really even bother with those. Um, you just get XP with players that are on teams, not division, which is pretty easy. And then the one I've been doing is this mini seasons voucher exchange. So I started playing mini seasons. Every five games you play, or every five games you win in mini seasons on all-star difficulty or higher, you get a voucher. That is repeatable, so you can get multiple vouchers per season. So plug these in here, you're gonna get 4,000 team affinity. And then every time you win the championship, you're gonna get a voucher. Uh, you'll get five vouchers rather. You put them into this one and you get 20,000. These are repeatable too. So I've been playing a couple mini seasons. I uh, finished the first one. I'm on my second one so far. So you can see I got a lot of uh, Team Affinity XP just from doing these mini seasons. And I'm at 27 to 28 games. I will show you guys the goals here. Like I said, repeatable. And oh, you get some for just like making the playoffs and stuff too, which is kind of cool. But they're all repeatable. You get mad XP for this too. There's way more goals, but I already finished most of them. So they went away. So that's what I'm doing now. They just dropped the ex uh, Extreme program. I'll show you guys this too. I found a little like hack to make it easier um i'm not gonna mess with a showdown because you gotta face randy johnson on hall of fame conquest i'm not messing with um mini season voucher exchange after i get some more of my team affinity guys yeah, i'm gonna do this one but i started team affinity so i'm gonna finish it so uh 10 points on the timeline for five and then two points for one so who do i really want to get is this Catel Marte? he is for 15 so You'll likely have to play an entire mini seasons um, and win the championship. Like what you just said, isn't too hard. Once you get to the playoffs, you can drop the difficulty to all star. It doesn't matter. You still get the five vouchers, but he's 15, so you'll need to win the mini series championship and win what, like 18 games or something like that. So just play an entire season, and you'll have enough to unlock him. Um, he is really great switch hitter. Like I said, pretty awesome, but I just want to finish Team Affinity right now because um, I'm going to unlock so many cards, and then once I get my Team Affinity boost too, I'm going to play some online games with that. But like I said, Mini Seasons is the easiest way. Anytime you unlock players, just kind of plug them into your lineup, uh, especially a lot of the captain players. Let's see if I can go into my Mini Seasons right now. I'll show you guys what I'm talking about. So, Manage Squad here. So I have Bellinger in here. I have... Um, Shohei, of course, because he's boosted up. He's a freaking monster right now with that boost. Uh, D. Gordon, I just unlocked. Great leadoff hitter. Tommy LaStella. Josh Bell is actually a good switch hitter, too. Cedric Mullins, but pretty much just play with these guys in um, t uh, mini seasons. You'll get XP with them, which will get you more team affinity XP to complete this um, program quicker. And like I said, just exchange the vouchers once you get them. Um, I'll make a video once I get uh, Ramirez, but... That's how I'm doing it. That's how I found the most effective way to do it is. I'll usually just play mini seasons, uh, throw something on like YouTube, Netflix, something like that. Watch it side by side while I'm playing this game. There is some pretty dope UFC fights on tonight, so I may uh, just fucking do this shit while the prelims are on because the entire main card's stacked. Um, I may actually watch some of the main card, or play this while I'm watching some of the main card fights too. Down in the comments real quick, who do you guys have if you're watching this uh, before the fights end? Poirier or Gaethje? I like both dudes. Um, I'd honestly like to see 
Justin Gaethje win. The guy's just, they're both savages, but he's really fun to watch. And I think this is his last title run. So I'd like to see Gaethje win. Co main event, um, I have Jan Blahovic just laying on that Pereira dude and just um, not beating him easily. I think it'll go to the decision, but he will get dominated via wrestling. So. There is some useless USC, UFC trivia for you guys. And like I said, mini seasons, plug the guys into your lineup. Easiest way to complete that. Get that monster, Jose Ramirez card, and you guys will be good to go. So thanks for watching. Subscribe to the channel. Uh, hit the thumbs up button. Uh, do all that gay stuff if you want to see more videos from me. And I will catch you guys in the next one. So thank you for watching, and we are out.